All right. Okay. Technical difficulties. All right. Um, this is a very quick. I'm gonna try to make this a quick video. So I've been, and and maybe I'll make a longer one later. But I've been surfing, surfing the internet, and a hot topic. Well, a it's it's always been around, but a hotter topic as of late is this whole Illuminati uh, stuff, uh, for lack of a better word. Um, I will try to say what I what I what I what I want to say. Uh, okay, well, you know, um, I saw a video um, from. Uh, I guess it's Pastor Justino FP four CM I can, where he talks about um um Jay Z dissing Jesus Christ on Empire State of Mind. And also I think it's G. Craig Lewis, uh Pastor G. Craig Lewis, I think that's his name, um, played a song of Jay Z's uh backwards and it said six 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 murder Jesus. Um, all these things um have been have been just all over YouTube, all over blogs, and people talking about Beyonce being a devil worshiper and, and, and this, that, and the other. I'm, I'm, I'm trying not to, like, get myself caught up, you know. But, you know, I know that, you know, if you're a believer, you know, let your yes be yes and your no be no. You know what I'm saying? Um, one thing about me, I'm a, I'm a secular artist. I mean, I'm I'm not I'm not famous or anything, but I sing secular music um, that I create, that I write. So therefore, I'm an artist. I'm a secular artist. <laughs> um, but if there's one thing that I I find very interesting is that it seems like, and this is not a racial thing, but it seems like our people, you know, black people, sometimes we can be the biggest uh, conspiracy theorists. Like everything is a conspiracy, everything is 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 a is a big is a puzzle is a myth, and um, I will say this: I, I really don't want to go into too much detail, but people like Beyonce and Pr President Obama have been linked to, not linked. It's been it's been rumored that they're part of this this super super sect of people who rule the world. People, especially people that hate on Beyonce it's like this could it be that someone is just so super talented that someone is a you know is an Einstein of, of, of their era could it be that they're just really super talented and that they just have this wondrous wealth of knowledge of, um, and, and, and uh, determination and honing in on their skills that they're just that good and that they shine they, they outshine most most other artists could it be that that's possible? Yeah, it could be. You know, like, we are so quick to say, oh, no, she she must sell her soul to the devil because she's selling, she's selling uh, records left and right. You know, it's okay to be good at what you do. And it's okay to push it to the limit. I will say this. Whereas, you know, I, I guess... You know, we're taught, Christians are taught, you know, we're taught that, you know, you know to let, let your light shine. And you definitely should let your light shine. Um, the media will always play a role in your, you know, your uh, demise in Christianity. Because everyone swears they, they're in, in Beyonce's bedroom at night whenever she gets on her knees and says her prayers. You know, apparently if she even prays. You know, I really, really think that um, you have to be careful on both sides. You have to be careful what you put into your system, because everything is not everything is not of God. And I, just, <laughs> and then you have to be careful to, um, before before you judge people by what you, by your own perceptions by what you think. True, we were given a conscience. Um, this this is true. This is in Romans. Right? We were given a conscience. However, you take something. It's it's very it's, it is very possible to take something, twist it turn it around, and turn it into something totally different than what it really is. Now, you say, well, why don't you just come out and say that you're a Christian? That's a whole other subject. You can add Oprah on that one. You know, but one thing that I learned in church, 
uh, a couple Sundays ago. Is you do the best that you can. You do the best that you can, and whatever the enemy, uh, the devil, Lucifer, Shaitan, whatever they put in your, with, try to whisper in your ear. You say, you tell them, you tell your enemy. I'm gonna, you gonna take that with God. Take that, with, take that with Jesus, because that's nothing. That's not. That has nothing to do with me. Like you yourself turn away from things that are displeasing. Um, and you know it is. It is. I, I believe it is a mission of ours to shed light. You know, in dark areas. But what you have to do is you make sure that you have all all your thing, all your ducks in a row before you before you blast anyone, before you blast someone. And just because someone is good at what they do does not mean that they're a super saiyan. <laughs> does not mean they're Goku, and does not mean that they were picked to rule the world. Um, you know, it's little things that that I, I watch. I'm not saying, and I'm, 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 I'm telling you what I what I've what I just what I've seen. I, I remember I got uh, obviously I'm a Beyonce fan, but see I'm not even gonna get into all that. But basically, educate yourself on what you know. It, you know, one thing that rappers do. I know as an artist, I do this a lot. Um, I will write things. And I'll make, um, you know, I, just just out for the sake of creativity, I may put two words together, or I may I may use something to um, describe descriptive words. And um, you ever seen in old mob movies where it's like, you know, when somebody has a gun and they're about to shoot the person, and say only God can save you now, or not even God can save you now. Um, they're not saying. This is my interpretation. They're not saying. That, you know, when you die, your soul, you know, won't go to heaven. They're saying that right now, this is your only option to is to die. And and that's kind of what what I, I interpret Jay-Z might be saying is like, you know, you you're going to listen to me. I'm going to slay these tracks. I'm going to slay this track and you're going to listen to me. You know, I'm, that's that's just saying that you can't escape my, my, my ears. But this, again, that's just my interpretation. But I challenge you um, to. Look outside yourself and look outside what you think uh, might be the interpretation. And see, not, I'm not saying see the dark side, but look at it for what you think it is and what, you, and what, is, and what it might not be. Look at, look at both things. Also, I don't necessarily believe in coincidence. Uh, with that being said, it's like, well, that just washes this whole argument out the, you know, it, it, I don't. I believe that everything happens for a reason. Um... But, like I said, you, like, get your studying up, and um, don't ever let anyone tell you that this is what it is, and hand you something, and you just eat it. Like, you study, and that's that's the main thing you have to do. I mean, I'm not saying study the artist, I mean, really, study the word, but, like, if you're gonna, if you're gonna attack something, make sure you know what you're talking about, you know what I'm saying? And, um, that's all. And I, there could be rebuttals. I mean, well, not print rebuttals, because only people that look, read, watch my videos are my friends. And if if you if you disagree or you agree, then let me know. Um, but I'm just saying, everybody's not out. Everybody's not out to uh, to uh, to uh, praise the devil. Everyone's not. Do I think that do <laughs> only what you do for God will last? See, I, I'm so. I'm not fickle and I'm not hot or cold. I know what I know. Um, but I, as I study, my, as I learn myself, it's not, it's not my mission to make you believe me. It's not my mission to make you believe in me. Um, believe in God because whether, whether you know it or not, I mean, that, that is the only, <laughs> I'm not even, you ain't ready for that, that part of the video. Maybe I'll make a video about that later on, but you, you just get your facts up, okay? And, and be a scholar and be be educated and know what you're talking about. I mean, not everybody was was you know has a has a thirst for for, for knowledge, but you should because if you're gonna put something out there, you need to make sure you know what you're talking about. This is not a diss at anybody. I'm always talking like I'm just some like I'm just known worldwide, but I'm just saying like no disrespect to anyone who has opinions, but it's just with your opinions, make sure you stay educated. Okay, all right, peace.